Hello students, in this video we'll solve problem 3.5.103. Problem 3.5.103 asks us to solve the differential equation y prime equals y plus x plus 3 quantity squared. Again, we know this is not a separable differential equation, it's not a linear differential equation because there's a quadratic characteristic to it, so we have to look for a substitution. Whenever we see a linear function of xy in a constant, we note that this has the form y prime is some function f of ax plus by plus c. Differential equations of this form can be solved by making the substitution u equals ax plus by plus c. So this is the substitution we make for these types of differential equations. In this case, we're going to let u be y plus x plus 3. Then we'll find du dx du dx will be dy dx plus the derivative of x is just going to be 1 and the derivative of 3 is just going to be 0. So this tells me that du dx is dy dx plus 1 equivalently dy dx is du dx minus 1. Now with this substitution we can change our differential equation. So I have a y prime on the left hand side. The y prime will turn into a du dx minus 1, that's my y prime, and then I'll have a u squared. And so what I've done now is I've taken this complex differential equation and I've simplified it. So now this tells me that du dx is 1 plus u squared, which is equivalent to du over 1 plus u squared is equal to dx. And I've turned the problem into a separable differential equation, so now the problem is separable. And I can solve this by a standard technique, so I'll integrate both sides of the equation. So the antiderivative of du over 1 plus u squared is the inverse tangent of u. And the derivative of x, the derivative of 1 dx, is just going to be x plus c. And we can solve a little bit. So this will tell me what? This will tell me that u is equal to the tangent of x plus c by taking the tangent of both sides. And now I substitute what u is. U is y plus x plus 3 is the tangent of x plus c, which tells me that if I solve for y, that y is equal to tangent of x plus c minus x minus 3. And this one parameter family of solutions, of functions, is the solution of our differential equation. Thank you very much.